Hello and welcome. Today we're going to look at combinations and permutations in Maple Learn. The binomial coefficient, combination symbol, and permutation symbol are available in the functions palette of the Maple Learn toolbar. Click them to add them to your document and fill in the blanks that appear. These symbols return a result using the following formulas. Pause here if you'd like to review them. The binomial coefficient and combination symbol, sometimes called n choose k, are equal to the number of ways you can select an unordered sample of items from a larger set, where the size of the set is the top number and the size of the sample is the bottom number. For example, here are the ways to choose a combination of size two from a sample of four. You can see that the total number of combinations is six. The permutation operator is equal to the number of ways you can select an ordered sample of items from a larger set, where again, the size of the set is on top and the size of the sample is on the bottom. Here are the ways to choose a permutation of two items from a sample of four. You can see that there are 12 of them. These three symbols can accept numbers, variables, which will adjust in real time, and equations. Note finally that these symbols are specialized and cannot be accessed without the toolbar. That is, you cannot manually type a C to get the combination symbol. You have to use the one in the toolbar. For more information on the mathematical use of permutations and combinations, check out the counting section of the Maple Learn document gallery. Thank you for watching and have fun enumerating.